Time to find out what everyone is checking out today online. Here with that information, News at 630 producer Nikki Bussey. And Nikki, there's a lot of talk today, and a lot of people have probably seen this and wondered, what is this all about, right? It's the about removing a leader. Right, it's the Stop Coney movement. It's taking flight in Twitter with the hashtag Stop Coney. Now, lots of celebrities are backing it, including Gaga, Justin Bieber, and Rihanna. Coney 2012 wants to get Joseph Coney out of power by making him famous. According to the group's website, he is um, he's the leader of the Lord's Resistance Army, which is made up mainly of children. And to read more on this movement and to know how you can help, just look at the homepage of foxwilmington.com. Yeah, it's really gathering everywhere a lot of steam. today. Everywhere. I know, I've yeah, seen it. Facebook, All over the place. Google, Twitter, Yahoo, everywhere. But there were also lots of searches today for solar flares. NASA says that there's an increase in them, but that's okay. It's normal because it's part of the sun's expected 11-year cycle. But it is expected to peak in, the, in late 2013. But they also say the flares could interfere with some radio navigation and shortwave radio. If you had any problems with that today, could explain it. That's such a cool video when you look yeah, at that. I know, I love it. Like that. It's like a giant explosion on the sun and it just kind of goes away there after a second. It's really so neat. It's scary, it. but it's good to know that it's not bad. We're lucky yeah. we haven't had any kind of real major problems. interruption. Yeah. Yeah, oh, yeah. Whitney Houston's only child will inherit her mother's fortune. According to the singer's will, daughter Bobby Christina will get everything Houston owned from home furnishings to jewelry to cars. As you remember, Houston died February 11th. She was only 48. I just can't get over that. I know. Only 48. Mm. And it looks like Jessica Simpson is having a little girl, and she's not hiding her pregnant figure. She's posing nude on the April cover of Elle magazine. Whoa. A little risque, so we're not going to show it. She and fiance <laughs> Eric Johnson say the girl's expected to arrive sometime this spring. She hopes it has her fashion. But John told me he really wanted to see that. So, oh, yeah, well, he was I mean, excited about it. If, if you look at it, it has the same look that uh, Demi, Demi Moore That's did. What it went Something about. similar to that yeah. kind of approach. I thought that right? was very tasteful. Yeah. 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 So it's not, it's be, not. Uh, and what's the magazine again? L? I think so, yeah. Hold yeah. on. Yeah, L magazine. magazine. Those, L magazine. Yeah, so, I mean, Anyone wants to be, pick uh, it up right. on newsstands? Yep. Pregnancy is a beautiful thing. Yep, and again, it, it uh, she says it's you know they're gonna have a a, chi a girl, right? Little Is girl. that what they're saying? So pretty happy. Oh, yeah, that's great. Yeah, good, good for her. Yeah. I'm glad to see her finding happiness. Yeah, good. She had the struggles for a while. Oh yeah, she was sad there for a yeah. hot minute. Well, I hope you got to enjoy the sunshine today. Yeah, meteorologist Eric Davis says uh, we won't see much of it tomorrow. A wet Friday in the forecast. Two minutes away.